Hello Carlton Digby School, missing you all. We should have been going back to school today but unfortunately we are all still at home. So if we were at school today in yellow department we were going to start learning about stories from traditional tales and this week I was going to do lots of things about the three little pigs. So here we go. Once upon a time there were three little pigs. One, two, three. The three little pigs lived with their mummy, but she said, you are all too big now. You must go out and find houses of your own. So the first little pig walked along and found some straw. He decided to make his house out of straw. There he is in his straw house. The second little pig decided to make his house out of sticks. Put him in his stick house. Oh, put another stick there. And the third little pig was a very clever little pig and he decided to make his house out of bricks. Nice roof. There he goes into his house. One day the big bad wolf came walking along the road. He got to the first little pig's house and said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. Oh no, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, said the pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Ready, can you huff? <gasps> and he puffed. And he blew the little pigs down. The little pig ran to his brother. The wolf walked along and got to the second little pig's house. And he said, Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, 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 not by the hair of our chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Ready? <gasps> oh, and he blew their house down. The two little pigs ran as fast as they could to their brother's house. The wolf walked on some more and got to the house of the third little pig. Little pig, little pig, let me come in. No, 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 not by the hair on our chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. <sighs> but he huffed. And he puffed and he couldn't blow the house down. The wolf was not going to give up easily, so he had an idea. Then I'll climb up your roof and come down your chimney. But the third little pig, who was a very clever little pig, remember, quickly got a pot of water and put it on the fire under the chimney and started to heat it up. The wolf climbed and he climbed and he climbed and he went down the chimney and splash! He landed in to the big pot of hot water. Ow! 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 And he ran away. Those clever little piggies were safe and had scared off that big bad wolf. 
the end. Now, I wonder if you've got anything in your garden or at home that you can think of making a house of. You could use bricks like we've got. You could go in the garden, see if you can find any sticks. You could see if there's any boxes. See if you've got any animals in your house that you might need a home building for them. It doesn't have to be little pigs. It could be anything. And then see if you can knock them down. Okie dokie, I will see you soon. Have fun!